Kisi County was clocked in a somber silence today as Dr. Eric Maigo, whose untimely demise sent shockwaves through the nation, was laid to rest at his ancestral home in Amasogo, Keumbu, Kisi County. Family, friends, and mourners from all walks of life gathered to bid a final farewell to the late doctor who had served as the acting finance director at Nairobi Hospital. Hello, my name is Chief Okuzo from Plug TV. In a heart trending tribute, Dr. Maigo's family passionately defended his character against the cloud of controversy that had surrounded him in the wake of his tragic death. They refuted the allegations of his involvement with an underage girl who apparently whose mother revealed that she was not underage but 20 years of age. Describing my ego as a calm and devoted individual dedicated to God's work, his family implored the police to conduct a thorough investigation to bring the true culprit to justice. Eric's body before they took him away. When I looked the way Eric died, there is no way I ever much you hate a person. And I mentioned this to somebody. Actually, I mentioned it to my son, Robert Bichaga, who has talked here, that I wished they shot Eric with a bullet. Not to stab him 25 times. And Robert told me, hey, dad, you are cruel. Don't say that. But I said, how, what I saw you, you couldn't see before they dressed him. So it's painful. It's painful the way this boy died. Dr. Maigo's grandfather, Chris Sando Onchari, expressed profound sorrow over the loss of his beloved kin. He described the brutal circumstances of Maigo's death and called for greater compassion and solidarity among humanity. An autopsy conducted on Dr. Eric Maigo revealed a horrifying truth. He had been mercilessly stabbed 25 times before succumbing to his injury. Meanwhile, the prime suspect in Dr. Maigo's murder remains in police custody. Detectives from the Directorate of Criminal Investigations, DCI, apprehended the young woman in Kibra, Nairobi, on the evening of Tuesday, September 26th. The DCI revealed her images to the public a week after Maigo's tragic death, launching a nationwide manhunt with an urgent appeal for information regarding her whereabouts. CCTV footage captured the suspect's move within Dr. Maigo's residence at Woodley Annex Upper, where the crime occurred. Now, the DCI's believe she played a pivotal role in the heinous act before fleeing through a back exit at the crime scene. Two bloodstained knives believed to be the murder weapons were also recovered. As this painful chapter unfolds, the nation watches anxiously for justice to prevail and for answers to emerge in the tragic case of Dr. Eric Maigo. May his soul rest in peace. That is it for now. Thanks for watching. Let's me next time. Bye-bye.